So once you log into NOAS with your email account, automatically you'll generate an automatic personality dashboard of yourself and everyone in your inbox. And so what we have right here is not just conscientiousness, but consciousness broken down into achievement striving, achievement striving, cautiousness, health self-discipline, someone is representing themselves at. You can see Aaron's beating me at the, uh, at the conscientiousness. I will need to uh, pick up some conscious words and make sure I'm uh, paying attention to, the, to those traits. And so it is one way that you can uh, immediately benefit from knowing. The second, uh, there are also tonal measures we have. So you can measure how happy someone is, how sad they are, how confident the emails are coming across overall. And then once you begin to know these things, you can begin to adjust for them and improve them. And we have, we uploaded the Enron email corpus. And the Enron was a, a financial fraud. They had, it was led by Ken Lay and Jeff, Jeff Skilling organized that fraud and as part of their settlement and the trials the email corpus was released and it's been a fascinating study thing study database for a lot of uh, a lot of people and this one is Jeff Skilling's email right around the time he resigned and you can see a spike in anger and negativity immediately before it and so you can start to see like you know you can predict actually one study showed you could predict whether two developers will stay on the same team based on how how similar they are in speech and so you can imagine like timelines overlaid with people in the future um, the existing market um, personality tests are a 500 million dollar market growing for 10 to 15 percent a year but really what, what we would like to eventually help with is in training and improving so each word is sort of categorized based on how conscientious it is, how positive, how much anger it is exhibited, it, as well as various phrases. And so, in real time, imagine getting flagged outgoing anger emails. You know what I mean? So you go, you write an email, you draft it, it gets sent out, but in the background, it's sort of checking on you to make sure it's coming across how you want it to. And if it's not outside, if it's outside your target range, it'll stop you and say, hey, maybe you don't want to send this email. Or how about in real time, you can get real time word suggestions like that will reflect the tone and how you want it to come across. So those are the things that, that are capable with email. And again, thank you very much for having this. This is our awesome team. Um, I can't speak enough about how hard they worked. Imagine like coming together in only a month, like putting together this product. Like, you know, some of us know each other from from before most of us are just new and learning to work with each other for the very first time and so it took a lot of people and a lot of uh, and you know we don't know our skills together and I'm very proud of them and we d I think uh, I couldn't speak highly enough of them and want to thank them so much so uh, thank you for your time and enjoy